What's going on guys? It's your boy DPJ here today with another Destiny video and today I bring you this epic loot haul. In this video we will see my true meaning of war loot results for the past two weeks, my Iron Banner rank 5 packages across all three of my characters and my Nightfall looting results across all three of my characters for the past week. But before we go any further, if you guys do enjoy the video, leaving a like would be very much appreciated and the epic support you guys show me really does help out. Okay, so getting straight into the loot and let's first start off with my true meaning of war loot. On my hunter from last week, I got the Revelator dropping at a 335 with Surrounded and Third Eye. This hand cannon in my opinion is below par with the likes of the Lord High Fixer and the Ice Luna, so it's basically pointless me keeping it and it was used for infusion. This week on my Hunter I got 17 strange coins. On my Titan from last week I received the Red Death dropping at a disappointing 334. This week on my Titan I received the Exotic Gauntlets, the No Backup Plans dropping at a 334 defense. But believe it or not I actually don't have a year 2 version of these so I'm happy with them. On my Warlock from last week I received the Revelator again, again though dropping at a 335 attack so they're basically only good for infusion. This week on my Warlock I received the Red Spectre, dropping at 332 due to my level, dropping with Hot Swap and Hidden Hand, so not too bad of weapon perks to be honest, but in my opinion this thing does need stability, but I will try it out nonetheless. Okay, so we're going to move on to my Iron Banner loot results. And the end of game rewards, I actually didn't get too many of them. I only had 10 drops. I will add though that I didn't start playing Iron Banner until the Saturday due to being at Gamescom. So I didn't play as long as I would have if I didn't go to Germany. And because XP gains improve towards the end of the week, it's way easier and takes less matches to rank up to that rank 5. But I did get a few decent drops and a few half decent hand cannons as well. But none with that perfect roll. Okay, so we're going to move on to my packages. And on my package with my Hunter, I got the Haken's Hatchet. Dropping at 335 with the perks hip fire, perfect balance and third eye. I'm actually happy with this weapon. I mean, I deleted all the other versions of this weapon I had in the past. So I'm quite happy I got it again. On my Tyson from the rank 5 package, I got the Ash Raven's Flight, which is the fusion rifle. This dropped with hidden hand, rifle barrel and Icarus. Shame it was a 34 but still decent in my opinion. On my Warlock from the rank 5 Iron Banner package I got the Deedish Retort dropping at a 334 and with the perks full auto, small bore and replenish. I did however get a couple drop from end of game rewards with better perks but still this one in my opinion ain't too bad. Ok so on to my Nightfall loot and initially the rewards were absolutely fucking garbage and it's the reason I ain't done Nightfalls in months. But because it was the Undying Mind and there's a chance of getting that Imago loop I thought fuck it why not. So my initial rewards were as follows, on my Hunter I got a 335 attack 4th Horseman, on my Warlock I got a 330 defense Ghost Shell and on my Titan I also got a Ghost Shell. And ladies and gentlemen this is why I stay clear of the damn useless Nightfalls. But look at this, on my first run on my Hunter and killing of the boss within the Undying Mind I actually got the Imago loop, my first time of ever getting this weapon and the perks were hot swap, hand loaded and hidden hand which makes it a half decent roll for PvP. I know most people want this to drop with that Fate Bringer roll, but not me. I'm happy I've just finally got it to be honest. And if you do have a decent version of this Imago loot, let me know what it is down below in that comment section. And guys, that is the end of this loot haul video. If you enjoyed it, do hit that like button. I do appreciate the support. Thanks as always for stopping by, and I'll catch you on that next one. Peace out until next time. Peace! Get it right.